Hi guys, welcome to a new Vlogmas video. Right now you just saw me put up some Christmas decorations because guys, I don't know. I just really wanted to have some festiveness here. So I decided to put up our Christmas bows um, on our lights. And this is the other bow that I put up. Looks nice. Also too guys, I rigged uh, my uh, antenna, try to get it sticking back up like that. I just used this like tape. I think this is electrical tape. I'm not sure, but it's super sticky. So I'm assuming that it'll be okay. I hate driving and then hearing like dun dun dun. So that's what I did there. Looks pretty fine. It's black, so it blends in. It's all good. I also use the same tape over here. So hopefully this will just stay. But yeah, pretty productive day after I got the oil changed. Okay, so after that, I checked on the mail and I got this fun package from who other than Fabletics. I'm probably gonna end up taking the pictures now because I don't have a lot of time to be like taking photos uh, during the weekend and stuff. So, and I need to get this posted and I'm so excited because I think it's red and I wanted a red one, especially for December. I also got 16 free meals. You know what? I should honestly, I love how I'm like showing the code. Oops. But um, I should honestly do this and like do a whole review video that's like not sponsored. I might actually keep that and use that. This is the outfit. Oh my gosh. I think it's velvet. Guys, it is velvet. I am so excited. Oh my goodness. This is awkward. This is so awkward. Wait, wait. I just got the leggings. That's really weird. Normally I get a top. Um, I might not be taking the pictures today. I'll probably end up taking pictures. I don't know. I have to contact my person there. But yeah, I'm gonna have to like see because I would think that there's a top that's supposed to be with this because it's typically like an outfit. That's weird, but I love these. Don't get me wrong, like, oh my gosh, I can't wait to wear these. I'll probably wear these to a spin class because they are so adorable um, and they're velvet. I love this and I'm so happy that I got red velvet because my whole like theme and everything for the Fabletics like post for December was like red and like Christmas themed. So yeah. Don't mind the clothes here. I need to put those away, but I wanted to try on the leggings cause they are super, super cute. They're very like buttery soft on the inside because of the velvet. I think I'm gonna wear these tomorrow for spin because they're so adorable. This is just what they look like. I love this color red. It's one of my favorite colors. You can see my, like kind of my underwear. <laughs> so anyway, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what they look like on. We are exporting Vlogmas day 11. Guys, I can't believe we're already on like day 11, 12-ish. I think that's a little unreal and I can't believe I made it this far because, well, I can, because like I do make Vlogmas a priority, but right now I think I'm going to jot down um, like my video ideas for each day. So I'm a little bit more organized about like what's going on, what day, because I know on Wednesday, I'm like gonna totally film a lot and sorry about the lighting, it's weird. I just wanna show you guys, got my eggs here cooling off. So basically I made a whole video on this, but it was like super embarrassing. So I privated it. Um, I put salt in and then I wait for the water to boil. And then I put the eggs in, can't really like tell, but I put the eggs in and then I wait for 20 minutes. After 20 minutes is up, I put them in iced water like this and they sit. It doesn't really matter how long they sit here, but if they um, sit here for long enough and everything, they peel perfectly. And every weekend I try to like reset. So during the week, like I have my lunch, like ready to take to work and stuff. I just like taking a lunch. It's just a lot easier. And then I love saltine crackers. I know they're like super plain and stuff, but I had my mom get those. I think I'm going to, well, put away some of this laundry that had to air dry. Might do that. But first I'm gonna go through, since I'm doing like Vlogmas stuff right now, um, I'm gonna just like make notes about what's going up when, at least this week, because this week's really busy for me. I have stuff like after work and I typically like edit after work. So it's a little hard. It'll be a little bit challenging. Um, 
but we can do it. We can do it. Wednesday, I took off work just so I could go to a cycle class um, kind of far away. So I think I've already mentioned that. Sorry, I'm just rambling now. Uh, I'm just gonna update this. I just kind of wanted to catch you guys up on like what I've been doing, what's going on. Cause that's what Vlogmas is about. Okay, so I got everything kind of like laid out. So this is kind of what I like to do. I didn't really do this the previous weeks, but I did it this week because it's just hard, guys. So I have vlog from today going up tomorrow. Then I'm going to do the gingerbread house. I'm going to film a get ready with me for our holiday party. Um, I'm going to vlog and then post the vlog the next day. Um, I have a party, but I'm going to do a tag video. I'm going to vlog at that party. I'm just going to just film me. Um, and that's kind of what we're doing. I just like to take it one week at a time. I haven't like planned what this week is going to be yet. Um, I know I get off one of these days. I know I get off Christmas Eve, but that's already like too late. So I'll probably do some pre-filming and vlogging. They'll probably be like three minute videos, but it's fine just because I have to work one, two, three, four. And then like I'm off that day. And then obviously I'm vlogging Christmas. I don't even know what we're doing to be honest. And Vlogmas is over then. So we're just taking it one week at a time. I always find this week to be like the most difficult week um, because I think this week is when my family and I are going to do like Christmas cookies and I can film like Christmas cookies and a vlog one day. So that already knocks two days out of the park, which is really good. Um, it just all depends, but I find the middle week, I find this week to be extremely hard, but I think I've worked it out. Okay. So I got really sidetracked and I bought some new Lightroom presets just because um, they're called Gabby Fuller presets and these are them. Um, I was like watching cheer vlogs because I just find them to be interesting. And then in the description box, she had like presets and I'm like, okay, like, let me check them out. And they're like really cute. I love daydream. This is my favorite one. Um, just cause it's like natural and stuff. And then she has this one called cotton candy. This is my least favorite one. And then we have peaceful, which is pretty cool. I like the natural neutral tones. And then we have sunflower, which is sunflower looks like bad on all my photos. <laughs> so, uh, but these are the presets I got. If I remember, I'll link them down below, but um, you can just search up Gabby Fuller on like Instagram and then they'll pop up. But I'm going to try to use these. If not, the presets I always use are the Bianca Franco presets. I use her spring pack, um, but I think her last name is Henderson now, but... Um, I use her spring one, two, and three a lot, and then I use Bianca Franco Moody, and then this is just like, it gives like the darker effect, um, the very, very neutral, which I really like. These are like not that good on my photos. They look on hers because they're, I think they're meant for like DSLR photos, not iPhone photos. So we're going to see, I've been like playing around with them. I love, love, love how... They turned out on these photos. This is the daydream one. So this is before and this is after. Say hi, Valerie. Hi, Alex. Don't worry. Don't mind the trash. That's not like rotting. It's just stuff that we're going to get rid of. I always forget to tell you guys like, and I'm like, oh, they're probably going to think we're weird, but that's fine. That's what I've been doing so far. Okay, and now I'm gonna clean my eggs so I can pack my lunch for tomorrow. So some of them, well actually all three of these that I'm gonna use have little like hairline fractures. Um, I don't know if you can kind of see, but because of my technique, these things peel perfectly. Valerie's laughing at me, but that's like a perfect hard boiled egg. I mean, I've been doing this for so long that like, I can make sure every time that these little suckers come out perfectly and they peel and the shell comes off like smoothly like that. And I know that's kind of random, but you know, there's so many people that find this to be like so difficult to peel an egg after uh, cooking it, but I just find it to be so easy and voila. There you have it. It's all about the cooling process. Okay, so I'm gonna make my gingerbread house now. I have my little um, kit here. So I am 
going to have some fun with this but stay tuned because i'm filming a whole separate video make sure you go watch it if you haven't already it's coming soon um so just stay tuned actually i'm not gonna show you because i want you to go see the other video i might give you a sneak peek but it's not gonna be like in-depth review for the gingerbread house. On to probably what Valerie makes for dinner. And now I'm helping Valerie make dinner. Sherry! Hi. Sorry, you're in your jammies, I know. Jammies. But she's having her left eye done. I know, more fun tomorrow. Tomorrow, scary stuff, man. But um, I'm helping Valerie make dinner. Not really, I'm just helping with the sauces, but this is Brunei's and then next, I have to do the hollandaise sauce. So that's what we're doing right now. It is fun, not really. I uh, have to make sure it, it you know looks right and everything. But just finishing up the wine. And tonight's been a good night. Just a relaxing, fun evening. Doing some festive stuff and we're gonna watch Elf tonight. Yay, my favorite Christmas movie. Okay, so we're all ready to watch Elf, which is super exciting. Over there is my candy, uh, my gingerbread house, but I'm not gonna show you guys because I want you guys to watch the video. This is my steak, it's made perfectly. That's mother's medicine, don't. Fret, it is not mine. But Valerie made it perfectly, and I'm gonna dig in. Hopefully I won't forget to film the rest of the food, but we'll see. Because sometimes I just get distracted and the movie is gonna be starting pretty soon, so. And here is the broccoli Valerie made. It looks so good. Thanks, Valerie. You're welcome. We're watching our elf movie now, and that is gonna be pretty much it for this video. Comment down below your favorite Christmas movie. I would love to know. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye. Say bye, guys. Bye. Bye.